it's day one of the Global Peace Convention. What is up guys, it's Gian getting you all of your 2019 Global Peace Convention coverage right here on YouTube. So there are two forums that are going to kickstart our convention today. The Global Peace Youth Forum and the Women's Forum. And the Youth Forum starts right now. So how do you feel after um, listening to this first session? To be honest, I feel a lot of hope and I feel the emotion and the drive that you guys have, the spirit, that's what stands out most. During the keynote address, Shin Wen Moon mentioned how Korea sustained through the ideals of Hongik Inga from the leaders and the people. The young people are the engines towards transforming this world through the Korean dream. So the first session just ended where they emphasized the importance held in the youth in building a peaceful, ideal nation. The youth are the ones who should initiate this peace building through global partnerships. So there is just a keynote address by the chairwoman of GBW, Dr. Chun Suk Moon. She discussed about how women possess this nature of love, empathy, and harmony, and how women leaders should embody these characteristics to promote peace and the Korean dream. So we are here with Risa Perea, who just spoke at this session. Hello. Hello. Hi, so in your presentation, you explained that the Korean dream is universal. Can you further explain that, please? Well, something we learned in our project is that every single country has these core values in history that can resemble the Korean dream. And now, we are back at the Youth Forum, where the role of youth for the Korean dream just ended. Speakers explain the importance of exchange programs that allow students from all over the world to interact through service projects. This allows the youth to take ownership over the culture they want to create for a unified Korea. We are walking into the Global Peace Women's Service Project where North Koreans, South Koreans and foreigners are making kimchi for North Korean defectors. This was my very first time ever making kimchi, and I think that um, having service projects like this, being able to not only just to uh, and be introduced with the North Korean defectors, but also to be able to be with one another. It was just a nice time to share with my sisters, um, a time to be together and just to have fun. It has been such a crazy day with so much inspirational content. Thank you so much for watching day one coverage of the Global Peace Convention 2019. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that notification bell below, and I'll see you next time. Bye!